Welcome to Parev TV. The 2018 Smithsonian Folklife Festival, featuring Armenia Creating Home, opened on June 27, 2018, with a reception at the National Museum of African American History and Culture on the National Mall in Washington, D.C. Attending the reception was Dr. Armin Sarkisian, the President of the Republic of Armenia, his wife Nunez Sarkisian, First Lady of Armenia, Lilith Makunz, the young, newly appointed Minister of Culture of Armenia, Armenian Ambassador to the United States, Grigor Hovhannesyan, American Ambassador to Armenia, Richard Mills, numerous Armenian sponsors and heads of organizations and businessmen. The excitement of the evening, the music, the food, the speeches, was captured on video by Parev TV. We are happy to share this unique footage with a special thank you to the Smithsonian family and the Armenian family members, the artists and volunteers who worked hand in hand to make the Armenian Creating Home Festival a success. Enjoy this unique footage of video from the 2018 Smithsonian Folklife Festival featuring Armenia creating home. And so it is my honor tonight to read to you uh, a list of the donors that have supported this program. Mr. Albert Avgolian, the ANCA Endowment Fund, hashtag keep the promise. The Armenian Tourism Development Foundation, the Hovnanian Foundation, with Armenian Volunteer Corps, Birthright Armenia, Pike Armenia, Consul General Sergei Sarkisov, the AGBU, Aurora Humanitarian Initiative, Idea Foundation, Tufayan Bakeries, the Gomalajian family, and Mark Hoplomazian. Many more have donated, but I wanted to like, I'm gonna stop there because there's many, many people, but those are our biggest donors. We welcome the President of Catalonia, the Honorable President Tora, and on his first official visit to the United States, President of the Republic of Armenia, the Honorable Armin Sarkeesian. On behalf of the Smithsonian, thank you for sharing that unique and special civilization with us. Please join me in welcoming the President of the Republic of Armenia, Dr. Armin Sarkisian. In the history of every nation, at the end of the day, comes a day. Be that a young nation, an old nation, it comes a day that people raise their voice and say, enough is enough, we need to change. Because there are values that are higher than many other things. And that values are values of freedom, democracy, and equality. This museum represents that values, and I'm here also representing those values that just a couple of months ago, people of Armenia raised their voices and said, enough it is up. We want to live in a more free, more strong, more democratic, uncorrupt country. The theme of the exhibition is called Creating Home. As you all remember, a bit more than 100 years ago, Armenians living in the Ottoman Empire faced a huge tragedy, the genocide of Armenians. And this is a day that I would like to thank all of our friends, all of our American friends, the governments of Armenia, the presidents of Armenia. Special tribute to President Wilson and Roosevelt. Today I had the honor of visiting the memorial of President Roosevelt, one of those American presidents that supported the cause of 
Armenians prosecuted in the Ottoman Empire. It was a great privilege for me and an honor to be there. A hundred years ago, we created much bigger Armenian community here in this country, but as a result of a huge tragedy, Armenian genocide. So, California, Fresno, New Jersey, Massachusetts, even here in Washington, were full of Armenians who were poor, Armenians that were broken in their hearts, that had lost their homeland, that had lost their loved ones, and had to create a home, a new home here in America. And they created that home. And today we all are proud that the Armenian more than two million Armenians live in this country. They are proud citizens of the United States. And they are proud Armenians and proud with their history, with a hundred years of diplomatic and political relations between Armenia and the United States, which were revived 27 years ago. And they are even more proud that they have huge hopes for the future to have another hundred years of free, strong, democratic Armenia. Dear friends, this exhibition is a presentation of our values, of our home. But it is also a very important message and invitation for Americans. Come and visit Armenia. Come and visit the place that the humanity was created. Come and visit the place where you find the biblical, see the biblical Mount Ararat. Come and uh, visit the place where you will have friends. Come and visit the place where you will feel home. Like all those Armenians living in the United States or visiting the United States. Again, thank you very much, Miss Sonia. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you very much, America. And thank you very much, American Armenians. Thank you. Mr. President, for your words. Thank you. 